Since medical marijuana was legalized in Florida, dispensaries have popped up across our area. This is a map of just a few of the ones here in Jacksonville. Tonight, the nation's legal marijuana industry hopes lawmakers in Washington will solve a big problem for them. They can't deposit their profits in a bank. Action News Jack's Paige Kelton joins us live. Paige, that's because pot position is still against federal law. Yeah, there's a lot of money to be made in states that have legalized marijuana, smokable marijuana, but because these companies have to operate in cash, it opens them up to crime. Today, the Senate Banking Committee met with people on both sides of the weed industry to talk about reforming marijuana banking laws. Even if a state has legalized marijuana, banks and financial institutions are banned by federal law from working with cannabis companies. This has been a huge problem for the marijuana industry, which argues it may Makes business owners a target. Marijuana opponents, though, argue lawmakers shouldn't promote drug use. No matter how you feel about marijuana itself, we have a duty to look out for the workers um, who work in this industry and their fan for the communities they represent. The marijuana industry is hoping to gain many of the benefits of federal legalization without a debate over the public health effects. But make no mistake, a policy change around banking would have massive public health ramifications. The Senate panel could soon consider a bill that would allow banks to work with state-authorized marijuana businesses without fear of federal punishment. The House Finance Committee already passed that legislation. In the newsroom, Paige Kelton, CBS 47 Action News Jack.